Hey guys, it's Addie. Welcome to Mystical Monday. So today for the DIY, I'm going to be doing a really cool painting that in my opinion looks really cool and it fits to any room in the house. So today I'm just going to be doing a really fun painting like I said and I'll be showing you what you need and how you make it. Let's get started. What you will need is a piece of paper or canvas, two colors of paint, and masking tape. So let's get started. So make sure you have a surface underneath you so you um, don't get paint on it and you get your masking tape ready. If I could get it open, I don't know why I had so much trouble with this. So you peel a piece off, place it on your paper or canvas, don't mess up like I did, and you place it down and you could do any shape, but right now I'm choosing to do a square, you could do a triangle, you could even do a circle. It's almost Easter, so you could do a um you could do an Easter egg. But like I said, I'm doing a square. So if I could do this any faster and not mess up, that would be wonderful. I don't know how long this is going to take me, but I feel I seem like very frustrated with this tape. It like I struggled with it a lot for some reason. Any time now, Addy. You can do it. Almost there. That face, though. Okay. So there's what it should look like. I added some pieces to the corners because there were some, like, empty pieces. Okay, first color of paint. Oh, wait, no. Okay, also what you'll need are two containers for your two different um, colors of paint. And you'll need a cup of water to wash out the other um, color once you start doing that. Also, you need a paintbrush, and this is what your thing should sort of look like depending on where you place the square with your tape. So, then you'll just take your paint here, just a thing. You're just going to get started painting. Okay, so, as you saw, I finished that. So, you might want to wait till it's dry to take off the tape, but that is your decision. So, there it is, and it'll look really cool once the tape is all off. Let's see if I can, because you don't want to wait till it's completely dry, then the paint that got over it um, will, like, dry on top of it. So, you're just going to peel it off slowly because you don't want to rip the canvas or paper whatever you're using and then ah. okay so there's that you might want to have like a bag ready or something to throw it in because there is wet paint on it okay so you need this other strip on top, well, you can do whatever you want. Ah. Okay. Don't you love the beautiful music behind the? Okay. I can't really see my face right now, but I think you can see partial. Oh, this partially. Then you're gonna get the last piece off. Then, okay, if there are some like weird pieces, you're just gonna go ahead, take your paintbrush. I made it, there you are. Get all the excess off of your second color.
go back to the first color if there are some weird pieces because mine is like there's some pieces that just like because the tape it just kind of like got a little messed up but that's okay because I mean you can always fix it You can choose to put glitter on it or anything extra on it. So here is it after all of the tape is taken off and the paint is all applied. In my opinion, I think it looks pretty cool and this can make a perfect attachment to any room in the house. So, um, yeah, you're just gonna wait for it to dry. Then, boom, you got yourself a beautiful painting. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this quick, easy, fun DIY, please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Please don't forget to subscribe. Please comment down below for any other DIYs you guys like me to do. Or any other challenges or anything I do on my channel. So, um, thank you guys so much for watching. Again, Please don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment, and I'll see you guys all on Weird Wednesday. Bye. Stay weird. Please enjoy these weird clips while I was just being weird while filming the video and grab some a few random things in my room that I just started um, being, yeah, just, yeah. Um, I look so fab in those. <laughs> Bye. I love you guys so much, and see you guys next time.